Hello everybody, my name is Jide Kene and I'm an actor. What made me go into movies? I guess Junior Waek, long vacation, watched so many movies. I was just like, okay, you know what? I think I can do a better job than these people. Poka Mezaya, 2015, Enugu, directed by Ernesto B. Started a lot of people, Yule Doche, Michael Godzin and stuff. I was lead on that one. Well, my work process for film is to be as realistic as possible. Now the thing with becoming a celebrity or becoming better recognized for the work you do is that you may tend to begin to have a bit of a personality. You may tend to begin to have um, some sort of persona, you know, what people expect from you. Oh no, that's not the brand, or oh no, that's not this. So my typical approach to any script or any film would be to put the character in front of my personality. So it's not about what Jide Kenna would do, no. It's about what Nam D, what Chi D, what that person in the film would do, basically. I think the most beautiful thing I've ever seen is in Jade's new film called The Brotherhood. There's a crash scene on um, near Lagos mainland, but I know we can do it now and say it's Chicago. Nobody knows. <laughs> but I'm just saying, yeah, watching the amount of money that could go into one scene. I mean, I know what the Avengers do. But here in Hollywood, that was beautiful to watch. That was breathtaking. You know, closing down the roads, getting permission from the government to shut down a major road that on a normal day would have a lot of traffic. I'm sure that was, that was, that was a big deal. So just being a big fan of Nollywood, not just an active player, I would say that was my favorite scene so far. So yeah, look out for that. We're getting there. My take on movie marketing in the industry is that we are getting there. Eventually, slowly, gradually, but we are getting there. And to be honest, um, I, would say, I would say that we are not exploring Nollywood as much as it ought to be. Look at the numbers we're doing on Netflix now in foreign countries, top 10 Africa. Even when we cannot say, for example, that this is our best foot forward, but they are great movies and they're doing the best that we can ask of ourselves right now. So that's to show you that in terms of in-house revenue, because Netflix is an international body, you know, so basically they're spotting our market, but it's just like what's going on in the oil and gas, we're not really getting the proceeds back. We're not really getting investment back, you know? So that being said, I think we can do much better by ourselves for ourselves without being hostile to any foreign bodies. That's one thing I would never, you know, be a party to. Nollywood Mentors, there's a lot of them. Hank Sanuku inspired me at some point. Uh, it was so good to see Michael Zorunye, a new boy, take her on the lead role. Iniedo in her uh, World Apart role. But all in all, if I were to say my, the people that I tend to look up for for mentorship as of today, uh, Ramsey is a big influence on my career. Uh, Mr. Richard Moffat Lamijo, someone that I really respect from far distance, hoping that I look like him when I'm his age. <laughs> and then I would look at Akemi Adetiba and say, I love what you're doing individually in the film industry. Kudos to you and Jade as well. Mo Abudu as well. Hi everybody, my name is Jide Kene and I'm an actor and I'm here today with Nollywire.